All right, Gina Graham is with us today from Creative Interiors. And I was saying, Gina, earlier that you always bring like a really great kind of like one piece for us or a couple pieces. Mm -hmm. But today we kind of want to get the bigger picture. Right. And we want to see what it looks like actually in a home. Yes, I have finally taken some good pictures that turned out well with the flash and everything. So that's, <laughs> that's like huge for us, you know. Camera and technology, yes. well, we struggle a little a bit. A little bit? <laughs> no, these look great. So let's go ahead, let's pull up one of the pictures and okay. then we can take a look and you can tell us what we're looking at. This is um, a cornice. It's a little bit different than most cornices because it's not straight across. It's a lambrequin, so it comes down on the sides, uh, but it's a bay window. And so it curves all the way in on a bay window. Okay, and, and so that what makes it, it a little unique. Yeah. Yeah, and but I it's, it's a solid fabric that has just a little bit of a design on it, so it's not like a big print or a floral to kind of give it too much attention. Uh, it just kind of blends in with the room. It's real subtle. Yeah, so this isn't one of those like pieces where the room is kind of neutral and that's the focal point. It's kind of the, right. the other way around. Right. So let's do another, another picture. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is my favorite. This is the headboard I wanted to bring you. Oh, um, yes. This is a king bed, and um, the headboard we did out of a, a fabric that has like little eyelash around the circles. You probably can't see it real well there, but um, that is just such a beautiful headboard that they did. And then they coordinated the, uh, the bedspread with the box plated dust ruffle. Okay. And Gina, was the, did they already have the headboard and then you guys kind of did something with it? We started from scratch. Okay. Um, so we, uh, I think the, the customer, if I remember correctly, because this wasn't mine, um, she painted the room and then we kind of went from there on okay. the colors that she likes. Okay. So we picked up the headboard as um, a neutral that has a little bit of color and then put the color in your comforter. Okay. And then a neutral de uh, dust ruffle. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, we're kind of keeping it all not so like, oh. <laughs> Especially well, on a king. Yeah, what's going on in this room? Right. <laughs> what else do we got, yeah. you guys? There we go. Oh, and then there's a little bit of color. This is one of my favorites, too, because, you know, I do like a lot of color. Um, and this has, you can't probably see real well, but on the back of the shams there, you've got um, like a neutral with a gold sham, and then the blue ones are in front. Okay. So you've got a lot of color that you can do variations with. So if you get tired of the blue, you can take those off and still kind of keep them fresh and neutral. Okay, and this, these colors right now are kind of uh, trendy right now. Yeah, you know, we had some more sales rep in. They come spring and fall, so it's getting ready for fall. And do you know the colors that they are just showing us? It still has some of this orange in it, but it was all this blue. Right. All this blue, blue and gray, blue and orange. I'm like, blue, everybody love blue. <laughs> Hope you like blue is all I can say. Because that's what you've got a lot of. <laughs> yeah. And do we, have, do we have any more? I think we have, yes, a, we have the look, chair. A blue chair. Of course, yeah. <laughs> And this one is very unique looking. It is. It's uh, it's very neat um, because it's got three or four different fabrics on it. You've got a teal blue, a gold, but then the throw pillows on it are bringing out like a navy. Um, and we've used this fabric, the chair fabric, in a lot of different ways. We've pulled out the teal, we've pulled out the gold, and then we've pulled out the navy, depending on what you want to do with the room. And so people shouldn't be afraid to kind of mix and match patterns right. and put it all into one staple piece. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah. think that looks great, even when though, they, like you said, it's got a couple different patterns yeah. working, but blue. Yeah. <laughs> we're, sticking with, we're sticking with the blue. Right. So, Gina, just in case, let everybody know where you guys are located at. Uh, we are located at 5280 Scottsville Road. We're across from Greenwood High School, and uh, phone number is 781-7379. We have blogs, we have Facebook, and uh, if you have any questions, just either call me or post it on our Facebook. Perfect, and I love that we got to see things kind of in a home. It gives us a different outlook on right. everything. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you. I'll see you next Thursday. Okay. All right, guys, Steph has a final look at our weather after the break.